Since USS Bonhomme Richard is on deployment during Valentine's Day, the ship's family readiness group held a celebration for spouses and dependents while their sailors are underway. They called it Valapalooza. Well, the event, we tried to make it an action-packed event. We had crafts, we had a magic show, we had photography. It was just an amazing event all around. Uh, lots of fun activities for the kids, as well as a ton of food for everybody to enjoy. Though most agreed, the mood of the event was festive and lighthearted. Its purpose underlies one of the realities for military families. Oh, it's very hard spending a Valentine's Day away from my husband, but that's the military life. We're used to it. Life goes on. This is not my first Valentine's Day being separated. It's probably like my fifth. <laughs> now, my husband's been in for 16 years, so we've spent a number of different holidays apart, including Valentine's Day. So unfortunately, not the first and probably won't be the last. But all the spouses develop their own outlook when it comes to spending the holidays apart. When we're separated, we basically don't celebrate Valentine's Day. I mean, it's not that important without each other. So we just do it for the kids. I spend more time with the kids than it being Valentine's Day for my spouse and I. You know, honestly, I think the most important thing is that even if your spouse is gone, it's important to just count on one another. And there's a lot of great spouses here that provide moral support so that this way you don't feel so alone even on the holidays when they're unfortunately underway. Oh, and I almost forgot, it wasn't just the spouses who missed their sailors over the holiday. Happy Valentine's Day! Happy Valentine's Day! Love your dad! Petty Officer Che Rose, Sweet Activities, Sasebo, Japan.